My name is James Conine, and um, I'm the owner of um, Conine Dairy. We are in Coburg, Oregon. We're milking um, 1,500 cows. We have always wanted a system where I could check the temperature of the cows, because that was always a, the biggest indicator of the health of the cows, is if their temperature went up or down. We just looked, uh, looked up some um, systems that could give me a constant, um, accurate temperature of the cows. And that's when we um, saw um, online, we saw advertisement for um, Smax Tech um, boluses. We got the boluses put in our cows February of 2018. Right now, uh, about 95% of our cows um, have boluses. And the bolus gets um, put in our heifers when they're, they fresh in at two, two years old and it right away monitors their activity, it monitors their uh, temperature, um, how much water they drink, um, and if, they're, um, you know, if they come in heat or not. My name is Stefan, I'm the CEO and co-founder co of Smackstack. Smackstack is an Austrian-based company. We have mainly these this pillars, so the pillar, I would say, reproduction, the pillar um, health is, is, is one of our major pillars. And when you detect diseases or possible diseases in a quite early stage, you are able to react quite early. And when you can react quite early, you can reduce the antibiotics because finally, um, this is what our customers mentioned, between 15 and 30%, they can reduce the antibiotic usage. Yeah, you have a much more sustainable production because, okay, the longer the cow is on farm, the better is also for, for, for everything, yeah, because it's much more sustainable if we have more lactation. In 2017, we had 47 cows who had um, DAs, displaced abomasums. So one of their four stomachs gets filled with air, and so then we have to operate on the cow. Um, since we put the bolus in um, this year, uh, we've had um, one one um, cow who's had a DA. The Conans were the first um, the first commercial customer from the US. Uh, when you're a farmer and you, you decide to buy a, a solution, which is finally a first investment, it needs to be a return on investment, which is, so if, if not, then you will not able to, you will not able to invest and you will not buy it. So um, I would say, depending on the farm size, till today we see in return on investment between yeah, half half to a year. There are different aspects where the, where the farmer can improve um, their balance sheet. So therefore, um, but all in all, I would say it's definitely a huge return on investment in comparison to the investment what you're doing.